Hello everybody, it's Lucas McIntosh here and I'm back with some more Super Mario World for the Super Nintendo Classic Mini. Um, before I go into Forest of Illusion, I realised that I've missed out two levels, um, Butterbridge 1 and Butterbridge 2, um, so I need to go back and do them. Uh, I would say Butterbridge 1 is quite a tricky level to do. Um, it's so named because you can slip off so easily. Uh, Butterbridge 2 is actually easier than Butterbridge 1 if you can believe that. But I'm going to go go do those and then I'm going to go into the Forest of Illusion. And hopefully uh, do the secret ghost house. And hopefully by the time I've done all this I'll have another video. So yeah this is Butterbridge 1. It's not a very nice level. Um, it varies from going left to right and then it even starts to go up at some point. There we go. Oh god. Do not try this at home guys. Oh shit. Oh dear. Shouldn't have been able to do that guys. Don't ask me how I did that because I don't know. Oh my god. Horrible, horrible level. Horrible. Oh my god, it's just so evil. Okay, um... Oh. Ah. Alright, I'm gonna go down there. From what I remember, this is how you do it. Right, need to get as far as I can because this starts to go up now. The level starts to go up. If you can believe that. I can't believe it. I don't want to believe it. Yeah, you have to kind of go where the game wants you to go. Oh, I don't like this at all. So I need I always like to know what's ahead. There we go. So I think I'm almost there actually guys, come to think of it. I think that's it now, yes. How's about that then? I've done it in one shot. And there you go. So that is Butterbridge 1 done. And let's just do number 2 now. Okay, there's lots of uh, flying sort of Coopers on here, so... Oh, why can't I get the... I was going to say, why couldn't I get the feather? I have no idea. Right, I'm going to try and fly through this, most of this level, if I can. Because why not? If you can, then do it. That's my advice. Oh my god. They throw their own shells at you. Or Mario heads. Oh god. Evil, evil things. Halfway point, there you go. Oh god, what is it? something there. If I can just get to it, if I can just... There we go, yes. I think there's like a pipe I can get to. Maybe. Alright. Oh god. Right, they're fooling me, they're fooling me now. Oh my god. Oh, what buggers. Oh dear. I think I'm in the bonus round now, so I should be alright. If I can just pick up some goodies, that would be good. There we go. Let's get out of this now. Hopefully it should end the level. I've got to be super careful now, because I don't want to screw up. Alright, go down. Oh, crap. Please end. You have to end now. You have to end this level now because, yes, there you go. I was freaking out, man. I was like, I'm not putting up with that. Oh, Christ. Brilliant. Well, that's done anyway. All right. Ludwig Castle, which is what I've already done. Uh, now, <laughs> I'm getting really confused. I need to go into the Forest of Illusion. Okay, Forest of Illusion 1. This level's actually pretty easy, um, from what I understand. 
it's not too difficult. I think it's like an intro level. There is a secret which takes you to a ghost house, which I will be doing in just a second. Just got to try not to lose any lives because the ghost house can be a real pain. I kind of um, had, a, I think I had a practice run. Uh, yeah, that's it. I don't know why I didn't remember that. I literally had a practice run before this and I found the exit, but I lost all my lives. I was like, oh my god. So I kind of know what I'm doing. Oh, well, bugger it. It's only an extra life. Uh, would have come useful, but well, needs must. Okay, the secret's really easy to get to. Oh, hello. Okay, the secret is right there. You're probably thinking, how am I going to get to it? I obviously have to fly. Well, actually, you do have to fly, but not in the way that you think. So when you grab yourself a P block and just go to the left. And be very careful because you've got Cooper, Cooper there, and then just activate the key. And just you just got to wait for Mario to um, deflate. Then we'll grab the key. That, like so and put it in the lock and there you go that opens the lock and this accesses the secret ghost house nice the forest ghost house I should say this one's a real pain I think we have to get on top of this section here there's like you on actually literally on the ceiling the way to do that is we gotta go forward but this big booze in the way right now so Okay, we're going to go this way. Okay, we're going to go this way. Uh, okay. Uh, now, this isn't as difficult as it seems because if you respawn in the area, the power-ups respawn, so it does give you a fighting chance at least, but it still can be really unfair, I think, in some parts. Right, we're going to get the fire flower now. And if I can, I'm going to try and get the feather, if it'll let me. Okay. Okay. I need the P block, don't I? To go through the door. And then I think I... Oh, have I done this right? I think I've done this wrong. I've done this wrong. Yeah, I've, I've totally done this wrong. Yeah, I've, I've done this the wrong. I've gone the wrong way. I've done something wrong anyway. See, it just takes you back here. So obviously, there's something I've just not done, guys. I need to figure it out. So what am I doing wrong? Let me have a look. Oh, just get lost. Oh, let's get the feather. Oh. There we go. There's another feather. Oh, just stop it. Stop it. Oh. I'm being attacked here, guys. I'm being attacked by booze. I can't. I need to figure this out. Right, what am I doing? I need to walk here, right? What? What is it I need to do? I just don't... I have no idea. Oh, I know what I have to do. I, I've got it, guys. I know what I've got to do. But I can't do it because these booze are in the way. So it takes you here, and then you go on top. Uh, so you literally got to go on top of the stage uh, through this door, I think, and that's the exit. And there you go, ghost house completed. Oh my god. Very tricky indeed. All right, good. I've unlocked something else. It's another. It's Forest of Illusion 4, but I'm not going to do that yet. <laughs> uh, I want to get Forest of Illusion done legitimately done. Get Forest of Illusion number one legitimately done is what I'm trying to say. Modeling up my words, that is actually a pretty good run. So I'm happy with that. Oh, go off enemies. Yes, I've got me buddy Yoshi. Oh my god. Here we are. 
lovely. I'm trying to time this. Oh, missed it. This always missed that extra life. I've no idea why I can't get it. I think my timing just always seems to be off. I'm doing all right. Okay, now I can fly. So I can fly for a little bit. And just fly over all this carnage. And there's the secret I've already got. And hopefully I can just fly to the end if possible. See how far I can fly. There you go. Pinpoint timing. I just hope every level doesn't have a secret. I bet it does though because it's the forest of illusion. I bet every level's got a bloody secret on it. Oh yes, would have to. Right, a water level. Is it a water level? Yes. So there's obviously a secret on here somewhere that I need to get. Oh, I'll just bugger off cheap cheap. We'll get the feather. Bloody hell, look how tricky these enemies are. Alright, okay. Oh, need to get out of here. Oh god, I'm, I'm getting really flustered now. I'm not used to this. I don't think I've ever done this level before. <laughs> I don't ever remember doing it, so I must have skipped it as a kid. Right, move Mario. Move, kid. Get out of the way. Please. Yes. I've got some protection now against the um, the enemies. Do you know something's telling me I want to go to the bottom? That's where I'm going. If I can just get in that little route there where that guy is. Let's try that. All right, so it's a dead end. Well, if you don't look, you never know. That's the way I, th I look at it. Unless it's a hidden wall. I don't think it is, though. I think only the fish can just swim through. I need to get up there, maybe? No, I don't. I need to go to the right. Oh, God. Okay. I think I know where the secret might be, but... I'm not sure. Drop down, drop down, drop down. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. That's a bit unfair. Ah. Something's telling me. It's over here. Oh, come on. Secret wall. How cool is that? That has got the coolest secret ever. Boom. And I've done it. Oh, every secret has a secret, has a secret. Oh, and I found the blue switch palace. Nice. I've got to be careful here, though, because... Oh. Okay, silver coins. Can I get up here, though? No, I can't get up there. Oh, they'll, they'll all fall down anyway. That's all right. Pick up some cheeky coins. Mm. Right, hit the blue switch. I think that's all the switch palaces now. I believe that's everything turned on. Yeah, your progress will also be saved. Awesome. Making progress. Lots and lots of progress. Alrighty then. So all the blue switches fly out. Yay, there you go. Right, let's do Forest of Illusion 2 legitimately now. This is actually easier than I thought, to be honest. It's not, it's difficult, but not so difficult that it can't be done. So I was kind of like dreading this world for some reason. I thought, oh, it's going to be really difficult and complicated, but actually, it's not that bad in comparison to other worlds. Right, 
I'm not going to go for that purple block because if I do, I'm probably going to knock into the spiky square thing. The SpongeBob square pants with purple and spikes. Evil SpongeBob. Okay. Go away. Oh, what a dodge. Talk about Muhammad Ali. Okay. <coughs> I need to uh, figure out this level now, figure out where I'm going. So I need to just drop down here, drop down. Okay. I think I'm going the right way. Oh, I'm not bothered about that Yoshi thing, I just want to complete the level if I'm honest. Take me down. There we go. Let's get out of here, go down. Right, there's a block there, but that's just where the secret is. Not that that it's not important, but I've already got it. Right, where where do I go now? It's got to be this way. Oh crap. Yeah, this is it. Boom. Level done. Not too shabby. That's that level done. Uh, what now? I've opened up. Oh, Forest of Illusion 3. It's all secrets everywhere. Oh dear, this level does not look very promising. Checking all the pipes though. It looks like they're bringing enemies down from everywhere. The bombs. Oh, good. Oh, come on. I just want an extra life. That's all I want. Oh, what? How unfair is that? Wouldn't give me anything. It's all totally random anyway. Well, I've got the mushroom now anyway, right. Okay. Okay, can I get up here? Okay. Oh. oh! Oh! This is too much like hard work. I don't mind saying. Move. Halfway point. Okay. Oh, come on. Mushroom. Okay, what is he gonna that bubble gonna break? Nothing there. Okay, the bomb, move out of the way. Oh. Mm, get some coins. Oh god, just get out of my way please. I just can't do this. I really can't do this. I don't... Oh, God. Oh, I'm doing it, but I can't believe I'm doing it, I guess is what I'm saying. Oh, great. There's three of them now. Alright. Stop panic. Let's go down the pipe. Ah, there you go. Secret. Very, very easy to find. There we go. <clears throat> Excuse me, a bit of a sore throat. And I'm on castle number five already. If I can do Roy's castle, then I can save my game and go back and do the other levels. So, oh dear. Okay, okay, okay. I need to stop moaning and get on with it. I'm just having a moan today. I just hate this friggin' level. Oh. Mm. It's all part of it though, it's all part of the fun. Oh my god. Oh. I don't want to lose my, my other mushroom. There we go, sorry about that itchy head. Right, okay, come on, Mazza. Okay. 
Move. Okay. All right. Ah, oh, phase one's out of the way. Now I'll move on to phase two. Let me move this out of the way. All right, the uh, one-ups conveniently disappeared. Ah, I know what to do. I'm not messing with that. There you go. Right, what do I need to do? I think I need to hit this guy. One. Two. Right, I've got to wait for him to uh, go down and then hit him on the head. Oh no, I'm dead. Oh. Oh, I see. I see what's happening. Basically, the room's getting thinner and I've got to hit him on the head before. Right. I think I understand. Okay. God, I finally figured this out. Oh, God, come on. Right, let's get another one. Don't know why I went there, but I've got the feather now. Alright. Good. Where is the castle? Okay. Okay, right. Okay, come on, come on, come on, you got this, you got this, you got this, you got this, mm, come on, you've got this, okay, <sighs> I can just get a good pattern with these fireballs, I'll be alright. I might make it. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! See, I know, I know what to do with the enemy anyway. I know how to beat him. It's just getting to him. Okay. Spike one's fallen. Spike two falls. See, when I get into this little rhythm, I'm all right. It's just I, I get flustered when there's just too many enemies on screen at one time. But anything like this, I can probably, I can probably do. Move. So I've got this thing now, so that's going to keep me safe for a little bit. Oh god. Okay, jump, jump. Right, okay. So I need to get this guy straight away, okay. One. Two. One more hit and he's mine. Oh, almost got him. Almost got him, guys. Got him. And there you go. He's dead. Oh, my God. And that took a very long time, but it's finally done. Oh, my God. Apologies, guys. I've just had it. This level just drove me up the wall, but it's finally done, and I can move. Well, I can't move on yet, because I've got to do a few more levels in Forest of Illusion, but at least I've got this tough castle level done first. Oh dear, and poor Mario has been blown up. Mario found his way through the forest of illusion and has put an end to Roy Cooper of Castle 5. Onward to the dangerous but tasty chocolate island. Well, not yet. In the next video I'm going to be doing, I think, a few more levels in forest of illusion, then I'm going to move on. So I'm going to end this video now because I'm bloody knackered. So thank you very much, this has been Lucas Macintosh. Thank you so much for taking the time to check out my retro play channel and my videos. Please don't forget to comment, like and subscribe to the support channel. Keep checking back for new retro content and please don't forget to give me some feedback as well. And join me next time for some more Super Mario World. Thank you very much and I'll see you soon.